Hey there. In this video, I want to show you how easy it is to use Parse Prompt to take an audio file like an MP3 and turn it into a, uh, a piece of written content using AI. So specifically, we're going to take a five minute clip from NPR and we are going to summarize it and write um, a sample summary. So there's a couple of things that you're going to want to do. First, uh, create a Parse Prompt account. You can try it for seven days free. Um, input, uh, add your OpenAI API key or Anthropic API key, um, depending on which model you decide you want to use. Um, also, you will need to create a uh, Assembly AI account, purchase a few tokens so that we can process and turn that audio into um, a written transcript, which we can then use to generate an AI summary. I get it, it's a, a few steps, but we think it's really important to use the best tech available um, to do this instead of trying to create it ourselves. We're simply kind of a layer that sits on top of the best tools instead of trying to replicate what they already do well. So in this screenshot, what you can see is an example of a prompt template. A prompt template is uh, basically a series of rules and instructions that, um, that you use to generate the AI output. So in this example, I have a summarize audio clip uh, prompt. Here you can see I'm using um, an audio uh, URL as the input and the output is text. Let's change that to Markdown because I want to use this in a blog post. Then I'm using the newest model by OpenAI. Um, let's make the max tokens longer as well. This basically controls the output length. So if you want to write a blog post, make the max tokens larger. Finally, let's make the temperature a little bit less. Now, temperature, basically, the closer you get or the lower you get, um, the more kind of robotic and predictable it sounds. The higher the temperature, the more creative and sometimes random it becomes. You can also see the instructions here. You can see it says summarize this newscast from NPR. Make sure to create the following sections, a TLDR, too long, didn't read, key points, and quiz questions. Let's turn this into a summary. Um, okay, let's update this. Now let's start processing the data. So I'm just going to give this a name, NPR, and then I'm going to input the URL. So let's make that, let's get rid of this additional metadata. We're going to process this. Now, while this is processing, it's going to take a couple minutes, but I want to show you something really quick. Let's jump back into that prompt. What you can see here is that if you have many uh, MP3 files, you can download a sample CSV file. You can input all the different URLs that you're trying to convert or summarize, and then you simply click update or upload CSV and it will batch process um, a ton of files at once. So this is kind of the magic of Parse Prompt is you don't have to use ChatGPT to manually try to process and generate these summaries. Instead, you should automate and do as much as possible um, with automation. Additionally, one thing that I have not included in this demo but is available in other videos on our YouTube channel is we integrate with Zapier, which allows you to do all kinds of really cool things. So for example, this uh, audio uh, or the, the output that I'm generating right now, which I'll get back to here in a second, I could save this in a Google Drive. I could send myself a text message when it's available. I could upload this into a, like a CRM or I could, basically I can take that output and send it anywhere using Zapier. Let's dive back in. Might take just, a, oh, here we go. Okay. So let's dive in. This is my output. And you can see that it structured it in the way that I asked. So let's look at the TLDR. NPR News covers a range of issues. Okay, looks like some new, no, uh, some new news. Um, we can see the summary here. Interesting, Alibaba lawsuit, got it. Um, and then you can also see the quiz questions that we generated. This is pretty cool. So you could almost use this for like classrooms and you could use this for your own uh, comprehension. Below you can see an example of why we need assembly AI. Um, what it does is it takes that audio file, converts it into this transcript here, which we then use in the AI uh, summarization. So this is the input, which makes it so that the AI is very precise because you're providing 
real life input. You're not asking it to generate this out of thin air. You are providing the actual text or the, the, the content that it needs to look over. So in summary, this is how you can use Parse Prompt. Um, we do offer a seven day free trial and pricing starts at $25 a month. Um, depending on how you want to use it, uh, pricing goes up. But um, yeah, it's a simple tool that sits on top of OpenAI, Anthropic, um, Assembly AI, and allows you to convert YouTube videos, audio files, PDFs, and a whole lot more. It, so you can repurpose content and gain additional distribution. Hopefully this all makes sense, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Thanks.